Welcome back, Phillies and General Colts, to a Brony Plays Minecraft. Here we are, looking out at Sweet Apple Acres. Or, well, a little bit of Sweet Apple Acres. I have plans to expand it. Plans, many plans. Um, I've made some adjustments. I made this chest, for example, which has um, EMC items in here. So this is just stuff that I'm... Actually, I'll put this guy in here, too. So just items that I can use for EMC value. There we go. All of that is in there. Um, I taught... Let me get some wood out here. I've taught apples. I finally got an apple out of one of my trees. So I can have food. I've taught it to my uh, transmutation tablet. So I have that. <clears throat> and let's see. Oh yes, I've been searching around through recipes. Now it sounds like I'm doing a lot without you guys, but that's probably because it's kind of boring. Um, I mean, yay, mining cobblestone and watching trees grow. It's almost like watching grass grow, only slightly more productive. <laughs> slightly. Anyways, where was I? Oh, right. Uh, thanks. So, um, first of all, I have plans to expand Sweet Apple Acres. And I thought about this, and there's not much I can do now. I, I, I could try doing something like with the... Using water and lava, I can actually build underneath this platform, so I could alter this. But what I, I didn't like use all the dirt I have very efficiently. Um, right now, I should like to grow a tree. You only need one block of dirt. So if I'm going to do this, the rest of this should be cobblestone. But it doesn't really matter because cobblestone and dirt have the same EMC value. So who cares? No, it does. It doesn't matter. And I don't get any. I mean, I don't get any benefit from this being dirt, and I don't get any benefit from it being cobblestone. You could say, oh, but using all this dirt, you could have built way out there. Well, yeah, I could do that regularly anyway, so no big deal. So there's some more wood, and that's good that we have some more wood, because I'm actually not going to put it into storage like I have been for all that. I've been looking around at recipes, like I said, and um, I found some things that I need to do. It involves these three ingredients right here. So I'm going to take them out, and I'm going to use them for targets. Oh. Make sure you replant quickly so that you can get a, a decent rate of tree growth. So let's start. Let's come over here. I'm going to need some crafting ingredients, I'm sure, but crafting some EMC ingredients, I'm sure. So a couple things I'm going to need. One, I'm going to want some glass. So I should really get a couple bits of sand, probably eight bits of sand, so I can use that glass, uh, that effectively. Um, and since sand has an EMC of one, let's just, uh, yeah, let's just grab this and we'll use that to get us some glass. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good, eight sand. There we go. We're going to turn all of that sand into glass. One piece of charcoal will do it. And let's go ahead and, uh, while we're waiting, I guess we should get some clay. Now I could use the cobblestone for clay, but a wood is going to work a little bit better. So let's go ahead and um, burn all the wood. I also want some string. Oh, good. That's already. I don't even have to target it. Awesome. So let's hmm. Let's get the string first. <clears throat> all right, 14 string. That's pretty good. That might be enough. Yes, yes it is. That is. A just enough. I can do that. And then coming over to the project table. I, I don't know what that was supposed to be. There we go. A fishing rod. Which you could think of as a string flail if you wanted to. It'd be kind of silly like that. Oh, goodness. Two trees. Lots of wood. Good, good. I needed this. No, I'm still using some things off to the side. Um, so I'm thinking I should, when I expand, I need to make sure that I've got two blocks to catch everything because you know, some stuff is like right here and so it can fall off the side sometimes. Anyways, I've got three wool. Let's not squander that. We'll teach it to the crafting table and we'll also teach it the fishing rod. There we go. And it knows all the rest of this stuff, but we have glass now. So let's go ahead and teach glass, which has an EMC of one. There we go. 
We actually have four AMC left. We could get some stuff. And this class can be used for a lot of things. So I'll, I'll put it right there for now. I'm not sure exactly what I want to do with it yet. Uh, part of me says, oh, make it into panes. But, you know, there's so... Look at it. If I hit you, there's so many things you can do with glass. Bottles and fancy, nifty things. I could have fish bowls. Um, I could have a tank cart. I could make a tank. Uh, pipes. There we go. I can start making pipes now. Just lots of things that I can do. Microblocks and yeah. Lots of things. Okay, so clay is the next thing we're going to duplicate. One of the things I want, part of the reason I'm so quick about this is because if you're not quick about it, um, in addition to not getting good turnover rates you're into, um, and not being efficient, leaves won't decay if there's another block there for them to attached to a uh, wood block that is so actually I really should take some of this stuff out first because also if, a, if another tree grows like I think the no one just grow? no it just like some really tall ones some really tall ones grow or something and there are they run into these leaves then the leaves won't fade I'm actually wondering if maybe one of these trees had branches because these leaves don't seem to be fading too quickly Okay, I don't see any branches. But I don't see very many drops from these either. That's worrisome. Ah, oh, that is so cool. Seeing the sun over the horizon like that, and it's still being super dark out. Like, right when it shows up. That's really cool. Okay, well, we've got lots of uh, supplies now. We can duplicate some clay. Oh, goodness. There we go. And we'll replant. Okay, now let's do the clay. Put the clay in the target spot, and oh, I was going to make a bed out of that. Oh well. And so let's just take some wood. We'll take six wood, burn it all, get a lot of clay. There we go. Lots of clay. Don't want to use all the wood to burn it? Of course not. Now clay can only be used for two things, um, pretty much. If you look here. You can make it into clay blocks. You can smelt it into bricks. Now clay blocks, as far as I know, okay, I can make clay blocks into a blue electric furnace with iron ingots and blue alloy ingots, but I can't do either of those right now, and I can crush them and microblock them and macerate them. Oh, I can macerate them into clay dust. Oh, and then I can use that clay dust to make construction foam, but not clay. Uh, that's a good way to preserve, prevent dupe bugs. So I guess, just for the sake of things, we'll go ahead and make a clay block that I will dig later. And I will burn it to get the clay back. I won't even dig it. I said I was going to dig it later to get the clay back. No, I'm just going to burn it and get the clay back. So much faster, more efficient. No many app not many apples falling. But apples are a pretty rare drop, and what, we've got them all already. We've already got them. Actually, we, we could fish. But no! No, I'm getting distracted! Why do I want clay? Actually, I probably don't want any clay now, so um, I'll have to put in two pieces of charcoal, which is a bit inefficient. I wonder if I make three more clay really quickly. Three more clay. Oh. That was six more clay. It's not the right number. That should be right. Let's go ahead and chop down these trees. Sweet Apple Acres is not very productive, is it? <laughs> well, I mean, it's, sure, it's productive in terms of lumber, but it's not very productive in terms of apples. Oh, that was not the right spot. That's fine. Lumber is really what we're going for right here. Uh, so let's go ahead and get some bricks and we'll start doing teach it regular brick. And that way we won't have to mess around with clay. And actually, we'll just do this because it's what we really need bricks for. Um, now we don't even have to mess around with these bricks, which, by the way, don't have many coke oven bricks. There we go. Um, but if we get enough of these, Do, 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 do alloy furnace 
which will be really good because do you know why? I know why. Do you know why? Maybe I should tell you. Maybe not. I'll let you find out. Do, 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 do. It's going quite nicely, I suppose. Actually, I don't even need to be burning the... Well, I've already burned it, so I might as well keep using it. It's like, why am I still doing this? For example, I can burn the rest of this clay now. Fook. There we go. Don't need it. And while I'm waiting for that, let's go ahead and make a bed. Um, really important that we do this because our spawn point is not here. Now, I don't know if we'll be allowed to uh, sleep in the bed or not. I, I get the feeling that we won't be allowed to sleep in the bed because we're not protected from mobs technically, but at the very least we can have a bed. And I should start, of course, by teaching it to the table. And I'm going to put it right next to the lava. It'll be a good uh, good source of heat. I won't need any blankets. Hey, you got to think about these things when you're surviving on your own in an island in the middle of the sky. You know? <coughs> you got to think about this. Oh my goodness! I'm sorry if that interrupted the video. That's more steam people. Steam people, stop bothering me. I really need to actually just turn Steam off. Not even when I'm doing the videos, just turn it off. Okay, so each brick is 64, each wood is 32, and I need four more bricks. So one, two, that's one brick, two brick, three brick, four brick. And now we can make the alloy furnace. I doubt the alloy furnace can be, no. Okay, it doesn't have an EMC value. So I'm pretty sure it cannot be used in the um, thingamajigger. And if it can be used in the thingamajigger, it'll... Well, I mean, if it... I, I don't know. I'm not even going to bother. I, I'm not going to need... It's not like I need to make lots of alloy furnaces. So, yeah. Who cares? Nobody cares. That's who. Alright, we'll put that in there for now. Put the sand away. I have an alloy furnace. Hip, hip, hooray! And guess what? I taught buckets to my uh, thingamajigger, my transmutation tablet last time, so I don't need that bucket anymore. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I might be. I just might be thinking what I'm thinking. I also have lots of sand. So, where did I put that bucket? Oh, it's right there. Ooh, sexy. Okay. So, alloy furnace. Here we go. Now, what shall I put in my alloy furnace? Well, that's a good question. I shall put my bucket in there. And you're like, oh my god, Litmus, you're putting your bucket in the alloy furnace. Ah, oh, why are you doing that? That's not going to do anything. You didn't even turn it on, you silly billy. You silly filly. That's true. I didn't turn it on. Here, let's turn it on. Oh, I'm going to have to give it some real wood. There we go. Watch. Just watch. Bucket. Boom! Boom, pony. Get out the way. Get out the way. I got some iron ingots that I forgot to take out of the furnace. Yeah. What now? What now? I got iron. I know, I should really stop that. <laughs> um, but that iron's really good, because I can use it for fuel if I need to, or I could just use it for tools if I wanted to. Um, using it for fuel, uh, for EMC fuel, that is. Seems a little silly at the moment. So let's see if we can't fish something. Probably not. Fishing takes forever. And uh, this is probably not the right way to fish, considering it's getting stuck. We'll come back to that one later, when I can make more buckets of Oh my goodness! It's a branch tree. Did you look at this? Ah, I really don't want to cut it down, but... Mm, I need the materials. Well, I guess that answers another question I had, and that is, using Tree Capitator mod, where are they going to fall? And the answer is, they just kind of fall straight down. I was hoping they'd all fall right, like, down, but 
like right down there, but oh well. Oh my god, it's raining wood blocks. Stay out of the how did it block it way over here? My goodness. Goodness gracious. Uh I, I feel like that Indian guy on the guild, even though he probably doesn't have that accent. An apple! I'm not hungry at the moment. An apple, anyways! That way, I'm not smelting the apple. I'm gonna put this wood away. Um, and I'm gonna put like most of this cobblestone away because I think I don't have much else to. I think I did most of what I wanted to do for the video. I've got lots of stuff. I have, you know, we're on, well, well on the way to getting a bucket of lava. Of lava. Bucket of lava. In fact, I'll bet you that if I took that 64 wood, remember, I, we thought that it would only take like 30 some wood. So let's see what will happen. I'm going to burn those 16. I'm going to start by burning one at a time until we get to a bucket of lava. Eight hundred thirty-two. Okay, now that took sixteen plus eight, and it might take a little bit more because we had some to start with. But we're gonna start with one lava bucket. I'm saying that to be silly. It's a it's a lava bucket. La, not la. I don't. I never liked that lava. It's a thing. They also say skeletons. All right. So that's that. Uh, and we're again, as always, running up on video length. I think so. I am probably going to end there for the moment. I'm not going to do anything else super cool. I'm just going to gather up more materials and get more lava buckets. Now, one thing I will do, and in the next video I'll probably uh, show this, is I'm going to start expanding. I'm going to use some of our materials and expand Sweet Apple Acres, and I'm also going to put an area for our portal. Now, we're going to have to think carefully about this, because when we start expanding, we're going to need more torches, or else we're gonna need a, an area for mobs to spawn safely because we're I think we're getting pretty close to the 24 block limit well maybe not maybe there's more to go but you know 24 blocks is a radius radial thing and if I keep expanding in squares then they're gonna start spawning in corners uh, and of course if I go over here to collect something then a mob could spawn way over there oh my god or a tree at least I'm not bored <laughs> Okay, all right, so it actually is for realsies this time. Uh, that's going to be the end of the video for today. I don't know what I'm doing next time. Got some awesome stuff right there. It's going to be um, 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 awesome. It's going to be um, awesome. There we go. I'm going to make some more lava buckets, and I'm just going to do that for a little while. I will show a video for expansion, and I'll show a video if I make anything else cool. But for the time being, like I'm not going to do anything with my iron yet. I don't need to. I, I don't need iron tools at the moment, so whatever. Point is that I have iron, which means I can start doing some cool tech at things. Not everything. Like, I can't do pistons and engines yet, but I can get a better start. I can make iron gears, for example. Yeah, take that. So there we go. Until next time, Phillies and Until next time, keep on trotting.